So right now we're working on a project called the Giraffe Welfare Project in Swing and Run um, out of Brookfield Zoo in Chicago. So compare the giraffe welfare from being outside in the summer for most of the day and being inside, inside of a barn for most of the winter. There's a lot of components to this study. Um, one of the major things is we put an accelerometer on our giraffe. We put that around the bottom of their foot. It's just in a band, it's connected by Velcro. And that'll stay on them for 24 hours. And this helps measure recumbency or when the giraffe is relaxed or laying down. We also videotape our giraffe um, twice a day, 15 minutes each time. So they'll be able to gather data on how they're behaving throughout those recordings. And then we also collect fecal samples. And then through the fecal samples, they'll do hormone testing to see stress hormones and things like that. So to get the Fitbit on, we have a footwork door in our barn. So we'll raise that door up, get the giraffe in the right position, and then we'll put their foot on a block where we can manipulate the foot, ask for touch, and then we'll be able to touch. put the band on them for 24 hours and get the data they need. So we put the Fitbit on them once a week uh, for four weeks. We do the study for a month. We're doing it for the month of February to study their winter holding. But then we'll also do the study again in August to study when they're on exhibit and out in the summer. There are multiple zoos working on the study. Um, it's primarily in northern zoos um, because we have animals that are out in exhibit during the summer. And then in the winter, they're primarily inside because it's too cold for them to be out. So the ultimate goal of the study is to not only compare when the giraffe are out in exhibit in the summer to when they're primarily inside in the winter, um, it's also to hopefully determine if there are any welfare problems and how we can possibly fix them.